My friend Cordy is currently trying to beat Minecraft, but little does he know, I installed this morph mod, meaning I can transform into tons of OP bosses. And some of these mobs are so crazy, and I think we should start off by turning into this eye monster. All right, let me just finish getting this wood. All right, so it looks like Cordy is getting wood, and I want to break him right now. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go over here and hit him. Let's see if he notices anything. Wait, what the heck just hit me? Wait, did these leaves? fall on me or something? Uh, what is going on? Cardi really thinks a leaf fell on him? Okay, well, we need to turn up our pranks a little bit more because hitting is not going to do the trick. So what we're going to do is we are going to grab a bunch of these random dynamites. I don't even know what these do. And what we're going to do is we are just going to throw them everywhere. And as you see, a random stuff is happening. What is happening, actually? Oh my gosh, everything's blowing up and a bunch of random blocks are spawning in. What is going on? And Cardi has no idea what what is happening but you know what let's just fly in front of him and show him what's up Wh what are you are you doing this to my world what and uh, yes cardi i am doing this to your world so let's break you a little bit more you better run oh my gosh stop trying to kill me mr eye monster i need to get out of here and i'm surprised cardi is not dead but this eye monster has some pretty cool abilities which are what we are using since it can just do a bunch of random stuff so just to break cardi even more let's grab some more random TNT and let's start throwing it at him and let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, you're literally spawning in beehives, Mr. Eye Monster. Oh uh, yeah, I'm not only spawning in beehives, I'm just throwing a bunch of lightning now too. Please, look at what you're doing. You're literally destroying the world. All the animals are gonna die because of you. Oh my gosh, Cardi is so scared. And so Cardi is really scared. He literally started building up, but luckily for me, I can just fly. Uh, Is Cardi super scared of me? Get away from me. Please do not knock me off for all die of fall damage. All right, what I'm gonna do is I wanna do a little bit of a different prank now. So I'm just gonna build his platform out a little bit more this way. Just get rid of these random blocks. And we're gonna place down a sign that says, can I be your friend? And Cordy's obviously gonna say no, but let's see what he says to that. Can I be your friend? What are you talking about? You just tried to kill me, mister. Why do you wanna be my friend? Okay, Cordy obviously doesn't wanna be nice to me. So now I think it is time for our second prank. And you were probably wondering why I put down the sign. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab a nuclear TNT, a wither TNT, a meteor TNT, and a TNT firework, and we're just gonna light them all off, and let's see what happens. What is this? It's raining TNT! And, uh, Cardi, how are you not dead? You better run! Oh my gosh, I'm actually on a hard right now, and there's, like, a nuke everywhere! And there is a bunch of radioactive TNT. Okay, I think this mob is actually doing a little bit too much of an OP prank, so let's fly away and morph into something else. And I think what I want to morph into now is this thing called a Zilla. And it's basically like some, I, I guess like radioactive dinosaur. But now what we're going to do with this Zilla thing is we are going to go into the radioactive hole and we are going to go say hello to our friend Cardi. So let's just jump in this cave where he's at and let's see what he's up to. So hello Cardi. We're just going to sneak up to him. Let's see if he even noticed us. And we're just going to give him a little bit of a tap into the lava. Oh, I guess he landed on the stone. What? What are you? There's a giant dragon right there. Uh, yeah, there's a giant dragon, but Cardi is so scared of me. We're just gonna chase you. No, I'm gonna block you off, mister. Uh, no, you aren't, Cardi. I'm gonna get you. Oh my gosh, do I need to get out this cave? I was gonna try and mine some iron, but I don't think that's a possibility anymore. Oh my gosh, Cardi's talking about mining some iron. Okay, I wanna do a little bit of a nice thing for him since I've been really mean. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna run this command that's gonna replace most of every block around here with iron blocks. And let's see what he says. Wait, mister, do you see this? Wait, please don't attack me because I need to mine all this iron. Wait, let me make a crafting table. Oh, Cardi is so scared and he does not want me to attack him. Well, what I am going to start doing is start getting rid of most of the iron ore and turning it into air. So let's just run this command that gets rid of most of the iron ore and uh, slowly everything is disappearing. Wait, what is happening? I can't even mine this iron ore, but it's disappearing. Oh my gosh, the void is right there. Oh my gosh, Cardi is so scared. Okay, what if we run this command one more time. Let's run it. Let's see what happens. And oh my gosh, we can see the void too. Cardi is right. Oh my goodness. Wait, I just have to place wood. I don't think the wood's gonna disappear. Uh, Cardi, the wood is definitely gonna disappear and almost everything is disappearing. And 
now let's get rid of some more blocks and slowly this whole area is going to become the void. Mr. Dragon, I know you're doing this. Stop it. Oh my gosh, Cardi is so scared. But I feel like it would be really mean if we would explode this nuclear TNT right here because what this would do is literally destroy all these blocks. What if we did that? Oh no, did you just place that nuke TNT? Oh my God, I have to get out of here as soon as possible. And Cardi is almost falling down. I'm just going to nod my head. Yes, because I did place that. And what we're going to do is we're going to set your tower on fire, buddy. Wait, you're setting it on fire. I am literally building out of wood. This is so bad. And we're just going to keep getting rid of most of his blocks. Come on, let's go. And wow, he is still building up somehow. And look how much of the void there is here. Oh my gosh, there's literally almost zero blocks left. And Cardi is still building up, but we can get rid of most of his blocks like this. Okay, I'm just going to build up all the way to the sky limit. And I hope this is going to be far enough from that TNT. Okay, well, Cardi is so scared of me. He's literally building up to height limit. But I feel like it would be mean just to throw some dynamite right here. And uh, that literally got rid of everything. Oh my gosh. Are you throwing dynamite now, please? What do I have to do to get you to stop pranking me, please? Oh, what does he have to do to get me to stop pranking him? Well, uh, that thing is a little bit hard, Cardi, because I don't know if I am going to stop pranking you. But I do want to prank Cardi some more. So we are going to use our morph mod and evolve our mom into its next version. And oh my gosh, this thing sounds evil. But basically what we evolved ourselves into is this thing called the Godzilla 20,000. And I guess we shoot a bunch of fireballs. Oh my gosh, this thing is crazy. But let's just fly over to Cardi and let's say hello to him. All right, I need to go bridge over to that lake so I can jump into it and get away from the void. And what the heck? Whenever I use my ability, it accidentally like shoots out these rockets. Wait, that's actually pretty cool. And, but Cardi's probably so scared. I gotta not aim this at him because I don't want to knock him into the void. But I accidentally might. Wait, I just noticed there's a flying Godzilla. No, no, no. I gotta go even faster. Oh my gosh, Cardi wants to get out of here, but I think it's kind of gonna be impossible because I am exploding his build. So let's just get rid of all of it. I am bridging as fast as I can right now. Come on, I'm almost at the lake. And he is getting there, but we're just gonna explode him. Come on, Cardi. Hopefully you don't land in the water. And oh my gosh, you did. But now that Cardi's actually getting away from us, I think he's all the way over there. I think what we should do is find a new mob to morph into. So let's find a mob and let's morph into it. And now let's go and walk up to him. And I feel like with this mob, we gotta be a little bit nice because Cardi has uh, gone through a lot. We did some insane stuff to him. So let's go up to him. And what we're gonna use is this weapon called the Sun's Blessing. And if Cardi is mean to us, we'll have to use this on him. And it is insane. So let's go up to him. Let's just tap Cardi a little bit and let's see what he's up to. Ah, uh, what's punching me now? And what is that? Oh my gosh, Cardi is scared of me, but he's not being mean. Please, mister, please, I'll give you wood. Just, just do not harm me. Uh, he's giving me wood. Okay, I don't want your wood, Cardi. What I do want to help you is I want to help you beat the game. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this ability and we are going to use our attack and just destroy all the trees. And oh my gosh, my game is lagging, but uh, I think that attack did some weird like lava thing, but uh, now Cardi is super scared, I think. Mister, I know you're doing this. Please, I gave you wood. Do not hurt me. Oh my gosh, Cardi, well, I'm just gonna scare you a little bit more. So we're just gonna scare you a little bit more, and oh my gosh, he is scared. <laughs> Look how fast he's building up. No, no, no. But now that Cardi's like really, really scared, we are gonna help him out a little bit, like I said. Please help me, please. I literally, you are the only way I can beat the game. Please just help me help. He thinks I'm the only way I that he can beat the game? Okay. Well, what we're gonna do for him is we are just gonna make a path like all the way like this and we are just gonna lead him to the nearest village to help him beat the game. Wait, are you actually helping me, Mr. Blue Monster? Please just bring me somewhere really good. Oh my gosh. He, he actually wants me to bring him somewhere really good. So let's just keep building this pathway. So it's been a minute and we're still building this pathway and we finally got to a village and uh, Cardi, here you go. You are finally home. Uh, thank you for bringing me to this village. Village, mister, but how exactly am I supposed to get down? Uh, he wants to get down. Well, what we're gonna do is I guess to get him to go down, we're just gonna place a bunch of minecarts like this. We're gonna come down 
here and we'll just play some minecart track right here. And then we'll fly up next to Cardi, play some more tracks, and then give him a minecart. Wait, you just built a roller coaster for me. Wait, I'm totally about to ride this. Oh, wait, uh, Cardi, you're going the wrong way. Okay, I'm just gonna build a wall right here. Oh, I think I was going the wrong way. I guess I'll go this way then. And are you sure this is safe, mister? Am I gonna take damage? Uh, I'm just gonna nod my head. Yes, yes, Cardi, it is safe. Just, uh, go down there so I can do some more pranks. Uh, uh, you're gonna need to give me a little push. I'm stuck. Oh my gosh, Cardi. Uh, bye bye. Yeah. Now that Cardi's in this village, I want to stop being a mean monster. And in order to stop being a mean monster, we are gonna morph into a villager and do some pranks for him. So let's morph into the villager and let's go and find Cardi. And we're even gonna hold out an emerald like a normal villager. So let's just watch him and we're just gonna prank him a little bit and we'll just go and destroy like all the blocks near him. Wait, Mr. Villager, why are you breaking my blocks? And do you want to trade or something? Why are you holding an emerald? I'm just gonna nod my head, yes, even though Cardi does not know that this villager is not normal. Wait, why did you just give me emeralds? I didn't even give you anything. You just got scammed. What the heck? Cardi is so confused about this villager, but what I want to do to prank him is I want to grab a really OP weapon and I just want to hold this out to him and I'm just gonna hold right click and do this insane attack right now. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing, Mr. Villager? You need to put that sword down. I don't know who gave that to you. Uh, he is so confused, but we're just gonna throw it up in the air like this and see his reaction. Oh, you dropped your sword? I'm gonna use this on you now, mister. Get back. Yo, why is Cardi being so mean? Okay, we're just gonna hit him a little bit. We're even gonna combo him up and he is so confused. Hey, I would kill you right now, Mr. Villagers. Get back. Okay, well, Cardi's being really mean, but like I said, we need to help him beat the game. So we're just gonna come here and build this portal to go on to our next break. And oh my God, that sword is insane. Oh my gosh, this sword is so good. And wait, are you putting another portal right now? Uh, this is not a normal thing for a villager to do. I'm just gonna nod my head yes and uh, fly and start building it. Whoa, this is so big. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, villager. Here, actually take your emeralds back. Uh, he's giving me the emeralds. Okay, that's probably the first nice thing Cardi has done to me this video. But just to break him a little bit more in order for him to get in this nether portal, what we're gonna do is we're gonna place some times 100 TNT on a pathway leading to the portal and hopefully Cardi does not step on this. But we're just gonna place a bunch of TNT going to the portal like that. And if he steps on one of these pressure plates, it's basically gonna light off all these times 100 TNTs. And uh, I don't know how Cardi's gonna get in the portal this way. Wait, Mr. Villager, did you just place some orange blocks? What even are these? TNT. Oh, you just placed a bunch of TNT. Uh, Cardi found me out even though I did place it right in front of him. Okay, I don't know why he didn't realize that sooner. I'm just gonna nod my head yes and just go in the nether portal. And uh, hopefully Cardi thinks it's safe. I wonder if he will even find like a workaround to this because I mean, all he needs to do is just break the bottom. Oh, how am I gonna get in there? I could jump around it, but that is a little bit risky or I don't know what to do. I need to get to the nether. Cardi is so confused, but even though he literally just has to break it like this and walk in it and uh-oh, that's not a good thing. Wait, wait, you just set off the bomb village. I gotta go in the nether right now. Uh, I think I accidentally exploded this. Uh-oh, Cardi went to the nether luckily and this is all gonna explode and uh-oh, that might have been a little bit of a mistake on my part because everything is exploding now. But luckily Cardi got in the nether before this giant explosion happened. So you know what? Let's just go and meet him there. So let's light the portal and let's go. And now that we're in the nether, let's morph into our next mob. So the mob we're gonna morph into is this thing called the netherite monstrosity. And it's a little bit hard to see ourselves because of how huge we are. But we are huge and we look really, really cool. But anyways, let's go and find Cardi. So where are you, Cardi? Because we got a lot of freaks to do. And so after a few minutes, I think I found Cardi finally at this nether fortress. And it looks like he's been here for a while. But now that we're here, let's do a little bit of some breaks on him. So let's just walk up to him and let's just tap him a little bit on the back. Hello, Cardi. Oh my gosh. I swear, when I turn around, if there's a big monster, I'm gonna be really mad. Uh, Cardi's about to be really mad. Are you kidding me, mister? Get back. I have a giant sword that you are not gonna want to face. Oh my gosh. Cardi still has that insane weapon. Okay, I gotta be nice to him before I break him because that sword can do some insane attacks. Oh no, Cardi's gonna use that thing on me. Uh-oh, this isn't good. Get back. Whoa, okay, that attack is actually pretty cool, but uh, it doesn't affect me at all. Okay, I wanna be nice to him though, so we're gonna place down a few emerald blocks like this, and it's kind of hard building when you're this big. Oh my gosh. And we are just gonna place a sign up here that says, 
says, Want to trade with a really happy face at the end, just so it looks nice. And let's see what Cardi's reaction to this. Wait, you just placed a bunch of Emerald blocks. These are literally my favorite block. And wait, you just said, Want to trade? Uh, I guess so. What do you have to offer? Okay, Cardi's asking me what I have to offer, and I do have a bunch of Emerald blocks. And luckily, we're in creative mode, and we can get a lot of them. But we can also get some other stuff from creative mode that looks just like emeralds called lime concrete. So I'm gonna drop him a few emerald blocks like this and hopefully Cordy will say he wants more for the sword. Uh, I guess you're giving me emerald blocks. Uh, I'll give you this giant sword if you give me a bunch more emerald blocks. Okay, Cordy's asking for more emerald blocks like I thought in exchange for that sword and I do not want Cordy having that insane sword. So what I'm gonna give him is a bunch of lime concrete and hopefully he thinks these are emerald blocks. Oh my gosh, there's so many emerald blocks here. And we can give him a lot more because we are in creative mode. So let's drop him a bunch because I really need to take this sword from him. Thank you so much. Uh, I think this should be good and I can give you this giant sword. Uh, I'm just gonna keep giving you all the lime concrete I have because I don't want this. But let's just give you it all and uh, Cardi, please give me the sword now. Okay, like I said, I'm gonna give you this sword. Don't worry, I won't scam you. All right, thank you, Cardi. And now that we have the sword, we are just gonna use this on him and uh, that was a bad mistake giving me the sword, Cardi. Oh, wait, you're using the sword on me now. I thought we had a deal, mister. Oh, we did have a deal, Cardi, but I'm gonna come and get you. And let's go and break all the blocks near him using this world edit command. I'm gonna block this off so you cannot get me, mister. Oh, I'm gonna get you, Cardi. And does he not realize he's using lime concrete and not emerald blocks? It's a good thing you gave me all these emerald blocks and wait, you didn't even give me emerald blocks. This is lime concrete. Oh my gosh, Cardi finally realizes but I, now I want to do a different prank. And I have a way funnier prank also using world edit. So we're going to fly all the way over here so Cardi doesn't like see us because of the fog. And now let's morph into our next mob called the Alpha Yeti. And so let's change into it. And you can see ourselves changing. And now we're basically like some uh, weird looking snow monster. But now that we're this weird looking snow monster, we are going to replace all the blocks in the nether with snow, packed ice, water, and now now the entirety of the nether turns into this weird winter wonderland. And look how insane this looks. And look how much water there's coming down. I probably should have placed water in the nether. This is actually kind of cursed. But let's go and find Cardi. So Cardi, where are you? And oh, I mean, he is right there. I think he's a little bit confused because I don't even think he's looking at me. Isn't this supposed to be the nether? Why is everything snow and ice? I didn't even know you could put ice in the nether. Uh, Cardi is super confused, but we're just gonna come and punch him a little bit. Oh, there's a giant yeti monster! Uh, you're right about that, Cardi. And since we're this giant yeti monster, we have access to a bunch of ice attacks. And let's just troll him a little bit with all these. You have some crazy ice attacks, Mr. Monster. I need to block this off. Why is everything going wrong? I literally have no idea why. And let's just use some freeze attacks on him. Let's freeze him a little bit. Come on, Cardi, get over here. And oh my gosh. The good thing I have all these green blocks just so I could build as much as I want. Oh my gosh, I probably made a mistake giving Cordy all those blocks because now he can easily get away from me. But let's just go and bully him a little bit with all these ice weapons and this is kind of crazy. You're not giving me a second to do anything there. I am literally swimming in water. Water can't even be in the nether. How is this happening? And let's use this freeze attack and let's go and freeze everything into ice and look how much water there's falling. You are literally freezing me. I can't even move. What? Oh my gosh, Cardi has no idea what's going on and he's literally freezing right now. Please, I'll give you my emeralds. This is all I have. Just leave me alone. Oh my gosh, Cardi is so scared. And this is so weird. In the nether, literally all the water is freezing. But we still got more uh, ice attacks to do on him. So let's freeze him some more. I gotta go find that portal how I came here. I need to get back to the overworld so I can beat the game. Oh, Cardi is so scared. But let's just hit him more. And wow, he can get away so easy because everything is literally water. Luckily, we could use this command to get rid of all the water. And where is Cardi? Oh, you are right over here. No, you're still here. I thought I got away from you. Are you kidding me? But wait, the lava's here. And uh, wait, Cardi finally made it back to normal nether. I mean, uh, I, I guess you're back here, but since I'm a 
Yeti, I really shouldn't be next to all the heat. So I'm just gonna walk away and let Cardi build a nether portal to go back. Let's find a new mob to morph into. And I think what I want to morph into is this thing called an insane dog, which is pretty much like a dog, but I guess it's insane. I don't know. Anyways, let's go ahead and find Cardi. It's been a few minutes. So it looks like he built a nether portal over here. So let's go through this and let's go see where he is. And it looks like he's in the middle of the ocean and he's in a boat right now. Well, what I'm going to do is jump out of the portal into the water and let's just go and sit in his boat. Oh man, what a wonderful day. And now I can actually go to the stronghold and wait, why do I hear barking? Uh, it's because I'm in the boat, silly. I'm just going to break the boat and uh, now we're stranded in the water. Oh, it's a cute little puppy. How did you get in the middle of the ocean here? Wait, I'll build another boat so you can get back inside. And while Cardi's building that new boat, I'm just going to sink down to the bottom and morph into this really scary fish mob. We are going to use this shrinking device. So let's spawn another fish mob down here and make it really huge. And Cardi is going to be so scared of this. But honestly, I think we do this to more than one just to scare him even more. Okay, Mr. Dog, I built a nice boat for you. And uh, where are you anyway? So my God, my dog got eaten by giant monsters. And you better run, Cardi, because the giant monsters are coming to eat you. And oh my gosh, this is getting close. I am almost getting eaten, swallowed whole by these giant fish monsters. And you know what would be really crazy with these fish monsters in the middle of the ocean? What if we got rid of all the water near us? And oh my gosh, this is not good for Cardi. Oh, Oh, no, 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 no. All the water just disappeared. How did that happen? Get back. And all of the fishes are starting to chase him. And I'm going to spawn more and make them super duper big. Why are more spawning now? Everything is going wrong. Nothing goes right. I just have to get back to land. And all the fishes are chasing Cardi. And he's almost back to land. But I'm going to spawn in another one over here and make this even bigger. Whoa. Now there's one that's even bigger than all of the other ones. And this one that's even bigger is literally eating all the tiny ones. But he's... He's actually on land, and wow, I can't believe he made it here. But we're just gonna come on land and, like, flop around. Uh, hello, Cardi. Oh my gosh, there's another one here. I thought I escaped them, but one of these crazy fish is on land right now. And let's just go and chase him. Cardi's probably so scared. You better go and find the fortress, because I am gonna attack you, Cardi. No, I'll burn you, Mr. Get back one last time. Oh, okay, you, you are not gonna stop. Do you want a present, and will you stop if I give you something super good? Uh, Cardi's offering me a present? What the heck? Okay, well, I wanted to beat the game, so yeah, Cardi, here, give me a present. Okay, I got the best thing, and you'll probably love this a lot. Here you go. This is a bunch of super duper tasty food. Cardi, that is not super tasty food. This is warp roots. You know what? I'm just gonna take this and go into the water, and let's go and leave Cardi to do what he wants. Bye-bye, Mr. Fish. And uh, he thinks I'm a fish, even though I'm smirky. Well, let's go and find Cardi once he gets to the stronghold. So I've quietly been watching Cordy for a few minutes, and he finally made his way over to the end, and as you see, yes, I am an Enderman, just so I can blend in with everything. So let's go and watch Cardi and see what he says. All right, now that I'm in the end, this is the final step. I just have to kill the Ender Dragon. Ah, uh, Cardi, you are not gonna be able to kill the Ender Dragon no matter what you do. So before I actually make everything hard, I have to go and morph into the mob that's gonna go and destroy everything. And the mob I wanna morph into is this thing called the Mecha Godzilla. This is gonna destroy everything. So let's go and find Cardi and let's go and mess with him. All right, so I just need to go and destroy these end crystals and oh, what is under me? And Cardi realizes there's a giant monster over him, but what we're gonna summon are these like fireball things. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna summon these giant fireballs and you better duck, Cardi. And everything is exploding and oh my gosh, that just killed the ender dragon. What did you just do? You just did a massive explosion right at the ender dragon but before it dies we gotta get down really low and we gotta cover everything up and that fireball attack was really cool but i didn't think it was that powerful oh my gosh i just need to jump through the portal to finish the game and wait it got blocked off was it you mr godzilla uh the godzilla is gone because right now i am a giant gas and oh my gosh i look insane and cardi is probably so horrified what is that oh my god there's another fireball and what we're gonna do now is because I accidentally killed the dragon, we are gonna go and make Cardi's life horrible. Let's go. Oh my gosh, there's the giant sunbeam. I got an ender pearl. 
And Courtney's trying to get out of here, but as this gas, we have some crazy attacks. How do you even do that, Mr. Gas? Please stop. Oh, I'm not gonna stop anytime soon. Actually, I am gonna start doing some pretty insane stuff. So let's activate all these custom nether TNTs and let's see what happens. Hey, Courtney, you better run. Wait, did you just bless nether TNT? What? And oh my gosh, I literally got rid of some of the bedrock here. But let's go and explode some more TNTs. Let's do this giant meteor TNT. So let's place down a few of these and uh oh everything is gonna go chaos look at that why is there meteors now the entire apocalypse is starting and uh oh cardi you better run oh i'm gonna fall in the void there's a massive hole and oh my gosh cardi almost actually fell in the void but i guess that knockback saved him but let's just fly up here and let's ruin the rest of the end and oh my gosh we don't have that much left to ruin so let's explode a few of these pompey tnts a few of these nether tnts and uh uh oh, what is gonna happen? I think we might have broke the game, but there are so many meteors falling. But we're gonna explode some more TNTs because I don't know. I don't really care. And oh my gosh, these meteors are literally insane. Oh my gosh. There is even more TNT and meteors falling from the sky right now. What is happening? This has been happening the entire time I've been in this world. Cardi is so scared, but I have no idea where he is. Um, where are you, Cardi? And I found finally found Cordy, but what I want to do to end this off is I want to get this insane meteor TNT as this gas and just explode it right here and let's see what happens. Uh-oh, look at that meteor in the sky. You better run, Cardi. Uh, what is this thing? Why is the game frozen? Wait, is something bad gonna happen? And oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, literally everything exploded and Cardi is dead. What on earth happened? The entire end island is destroyed. Okay, I have to go and meet Cardi at spawn, but that was crazy. So let's just TP to him right now, and let's go and say hi to him. I have to go beat the game again. I just died and... Wait, wait. What? The ghast is still here. Oh, I forgot I'm still morphed as that ghast. Okay, what we gotta do is we gotta unmorph out this. So let's just morph back into ourselves, and let's go and chase Cardi. Uh, hello, Cardi. Smirky, wait, you're at the server? Wait, we have to beat the game. There's a bunch of weird stuff happening. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, Cardi, you're right. There is a bunch of weird weird stuff happening. Like, what? what is this hole right here? A giant monster made this big hole, Smirky. Uh, Cardi, are you sure it was a giant monster? What monster in Minecraft can make this hole? It was a giant Godzilla, and there was just so many different super OP bosses. Oh my gosh, Cardi. You actually think bosses were freaking you this entire time? Uh, yeah? Oh my gosh. You know, it was actually me who was freaking you this entire time. I was using a morph mod, and you got trolled. Wait, so is this you? Yep, this is me, Cardi. I'm flying right now. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I fell for that. I'm sorry, Cardi, but it was just too funny. Do you forgive me? Ah, uh, fine. All right, well, if you enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe. And if you don't want to turn into a dinosaur, you should also subscribe. Or actually turning into a dinosaur seems pretty cool.